They've expanded the tournament in 2012 to 32 teams, including the new Players Lounge. Oh yeah, basketball too. Pirates head west 10 minutes. They'll need to work together to top Sean O'Mara and the Red Wings. A seesaw first quarter, Javon Carter to Kalen Fisher, the 6'9 O'Mara, a big wingspan. The floater's apex an inch better. The Pirates' pesky press got to Bennett in the second. Colin Pelletieri picked by Paris Lee, 10 points in the first half. Red Wings 19 first half turnovers. O'Mara keeps the wings hanging in. Colin Bonnet feeds the junior big. He demonstrates the drop step power, 27-18. 29-18, Sterling Brown not phased. Bennett outscored in the paint, 14-4 in the second. 31-18 at halftime. Time. Third quarter, Donnie Boyce's Pirates still cooking in the kitchen. Brown baseline, bangers and mash. Takes the lead to 15. Gene Heidkamp hoping to spark a rally of some sort down 40-28 into the fourth. A 10-2 run is the result. Pat McInerney to O'Mara makes it a 12-2 run, 42-40. McInerney again, O'Mara smash. He had 11 fourth quarter points and a game high 21. Couple possessions later, showing off the nifty footwork, 45-44, keeping Bennett within one possession. Still one point at 47-46 with 132 left, despite O'Mara's big fourth back-to-back -back turnovers on the final two possessions, 26 on the night, would seal the loss, 50-46, Lee with the steal, then some keep away. Swashbucklers have a rematch with Oswego in the semis. We battled. We were down 13 points late in the third quarter and came back and had opportunity to take the lead. And they obviously just didn't make the plays. We saw them play um, last night. The ball was going in and going out. They were getting open threes. So, like, we knew we had to rotate real quick. You got to give Bennett a lot of credit. I thought they did a much better job in the second half of really focusing and getting O'Mara, who's such a tough uh, guard for uh, anybody in the state, you know, and he really uh, kind of uh, made his presence felt there in the second half and tried to wheel this team back in the game, but I really liked the way uh, our team responded. We knew it was going to be hard to stop him, so we had to, um, we just had to contain him the best way we can and shut everybody else down. When you play a team like Revised Luis, you get inside the last two minutes and it's a one possession game. You know, most teams are going to feel pretty good about that. Uh, the disappointing thing is, is we didn't play as well as we like and we were still there in that position and they, they won the last two minutes and that was the difference in the game. These are the reasons why you want to come to this tournament and play these type of games, you know. It was definitely a playoff atmosphere, and I like the way our guys mentally responded late in that game when they made that run.